later on BBC London and more sunshine on the way. We'll have a full weekend forecast. That's all coming up. Welcome to BBC London News. I'm Sonia Jessup. It's been revealed that people from Romania are sleeping rough in a camp hidden beneath the flyovers of the North Circular. Known as the Fortress, it's home to up to 20 people who say they endure the tough conditions in the hope of picking up casual building work. Gareth Furby has this report. And you can see more on that story on Inside Out. That's at 7.30 tonight here on BBC One. A mother from East London who abused, tortured and killed her eight-year-old daughter while under the spell of her lover has been jailed for 13 years. A motorcyclist who police wanted to speak to over the murder of a family from Surrey in the French Alps has been identified and ruled out of the inquiry. Well, time now for a look at the weather. Elizabeth Rizzini is here and lots of sunshine around today. Certainly is, Sonia. And the sunshine and the mild air have helped to lift the temperatures to 12 degrees already in Heathrow and St James's Park. That hazy sunshine is going to continue for the rest of the afternoon. It's feeling really very pleasant indeed outside. Just a light southwesterly breeze. Uh, temperatures are going to be higher than this. Some of them already are widely into double figures and they'll only improve into tomorrow. Now, for this evening and overnight, not much to report. The breeze is going to pick up. Clear skies. We'll see lows of around six or seven degrees, perhaps eight in the centre of town. It will be a mild night to come, a lovely start to the day tomorrow with plenty of blue skies around. That will continue for the rest of the day too. There'll be lots of sunshine around. If we get up to 16 degrees, which we might just do, then this would uh, this would be on a par with the warmest day of the year so far, 16 degrees in Gravesend it was on, uh, on the 9th of January. So uh, temperatures you know, getting up to perhaps 15, maybe even 16 if we're lucky. Plenty of sunshine around, certainly. Not quite so true for Sunday. Sunday won't be quite as good a day. And that's basically because we've got this very weak weather front just pushing down from the, uh, from the northwest there. That's going to go a thickening cloud. It may even give us a few spots of light rain around through the late afternoon into the first part of the evening. So not quite so good on Sunday, but still Saturday, you know, the day to beat over the course of the weekend. Temperatures will get higher than this. The real taste of spring over the next couple of days. Sonia. Sounds great. Thank you, Lizzie. Thanks. That's all from us, but Riz Latif will be here at 6.30.